What is going on guys and today we're going to be reviewing something as Mav Talk uh, enchants your experience with uh, Bluetooth car kit which is apparently USB dongle um, that connects to your aux if you don't have the Bluetooth audio inside of your car and it's really cheap it's only like 13 or 16 dollars um, it depends on generation they have like first gen and it's gen 2 Gen 2 is much smaller and it also used Bluetooth 5.1, which is kind of uh, crazy. Uh, I don't know. I mean, uh, hard to believe that some type of technology is going to be in such a small dongle, but I'm more concerned how good it is and how good is the sound. And apparently in this car, the Z4, uh, there's the bass stereo and the speakers is okay. They produce in good sound as far as you're not going above the limit. Uh, but apparently if you're using the aux uh, for the iPhone and you set like 80, 80 decibels, uh, the limit, the audio is coming out really good. And I'm really happy with results with just the USB uh, to the aux. Apparently the audio is run from the glove box. I can toggle everything here or just push the wire underneath or I even can go from behind uh, in this section which is really easy to pop out. But like I said the concern is how good is the audio. Let's open it up and see what is going on inside of the box. Send. Okay, user manual and a dongle itself and look at how small it is it's super small it apparently it's really easy to work with there's no need for password or something it's simply plug and play and the wire is not that long it's only about two feet let's see turn off our guy connect that connect this guy tuck the aux Okay, so it's connected as we can hear. Let's connect to Madhawk Bluetooth car cable. Okay, the volume is way up. Let's try to play some audio. <laughs> it's an advertisement. quite of impressed you know and let's uh, check the response it works in simultaneously basically there's no lag um, yeah I think that definitely worth 15 bucks depends on how long that product gonna last for there's all type of reviews on uh, Amazon I'll get you the link description below the one I got it's uh, Bluetooth 5.1 uh, which is uh, got type of smaller dongle it's like really tiny one the other one has little longer dongle which is uh, people also claiming uh, that is working really good. Uh, it doesn't really have lag as well. But the main concern was, is it gonna be some type of noise uh, that is usually comes with those Bluetooth connectors. I had the M power and it has extra dongle that is basically analyzing music, uh, downgrade the noise and so on. But this one, comparing the price, the M power was M P O W, I think. Um, it cost me like $29.99, some sort of, a lot of money, I would say, compared to this device. This one is $15, I think, that's what I pay for. Uh, the previous generation is $12, uh, which is still like $5 difference, but with that type of quality, the sound is actually really, really good. So it might be, uh, there's gonna be a little bit of tweaking into inside of the settings, you can bump up the, decibels 
that's where we're going to start seeing uh, that extra noise or the speaker is not going to be able to keep up with the um, audio but for 15 bucks not having issue with extra noise that is usually goes through that is uh, that is really good that is very very good results so um, I hope you guys like the review I hope you guys like the video and if so put that thumbs up button there subscribe my channel and leave me a comment below I'll see you next one